available would have been yeah, but it would have been a different story with a completely different outcome. Coming back down into the river, what I stood on gave way and I ended up sliding probably only a couple of metres but at full speed. The side of my boot hooked up on some bedrock that was in the, on the slip and it cranked my foot. At full right angle was to my leg. I pitched over a couple of times um, and then yeah, realised that it was, it was more than just a sprained ankle, it had actually broken something in my lower leg. At that stage we realised there was no way I was going to walk out of there. And yeah, so we activated the beacon. And within about an hour and 10, 15 minutes for activation, the, the helicopter turned up. I was just blown away by the service. So when they rang and they said they were rescue operations, yeah, I was like, okay, I know what this call means. You do actually get a heart flutter because you do actually hear it and recognise it as a helicopter and it's coming all this way just for you. Because of the terrain, he couldn't land anywhere near us, so he, he winched one of his medics down, probably a couple of hundred metres away from me, who made his way to where I was. And then um, he did a quick medical assessment and realised that I wasn't going into shock, but I did have a broken leg. The wind had picked up good old-fashioned wiper westerly by that stage, and it was probably well after 11 o'clock at night. He, um, he hovered above us. We could see the little red dot coming down on the end of the wire and uh, that was doing big circle work through the trees that were around us. And then out through the canopy with a few branches getting hooked up around us and then probably a 40 odd metre lift straight up to the helicopter. And then from there, uh, a bit of a U-turn and then headed for Wellington Hospital. Did a serious amount of damage, but um, yeah, the medical profession have done a wonderful job putting it all back together. And within 12 months, I reckon I'll, well, I won't be dancing on tables, but um, we'll anyway. <laughs> but I'll certainly be able to get back into the mountains and, and go back into the southern Alps again. There's a few places I haven't quite finished looking at before I um, hang up my boots. Mm -hmm.